This is the sickest kidnapping case in Austrian history. An 18-year-old girl was held captive in a dark basement for 20 years. Being then violated countless times and even gave birth to three children for her father. And all because the daughter said the wrong thing. The father was extremely controlling, and because he saw a scene of his daughter and her boyfriend being intimate, a heated argument broke out between the two as a result. The daughter didn't want to pay any attention to her father, but just as she turned to go into her room, the father grabbed her by the arm and threatened to forbid her from seeing her boyfriend again. Fortunately, her mother appeared in time and was able to defuse the conflict. Her mother and sister were advising her that it was best not to confront her father at home, but the daughter was not convinced. Her 18th birthday was in seven days, and by then she would have left the house and traveled the world with her boyfriend. And these words just happened to be heard by the father outside the door, who would never tolerate such betrayal, so a seed of evil began to take root in his heart. That day while no one was home, only Arthur and his daughter were left, so Arthur asked his daughter to help him move something, and without thinking much about it, she walked straight with her father. When they reached the basement, Arthur pushed aside the bookshelves and opened a secret door. This was a bomb shelter built by the previous homeowner, and Arthur was the only one in the family who knew about it, so he had been remodeling it in secret. It wasn't until Arthur closed the coated door behind him for a split second that his daughter realized something was wrong. She tapped on the door as hard as she could, but the soundproofing outside was so good that no one could hear her. Day 7 of Captivity Daughter waiting for her father to open the door is not ready to try to escape, but it is desperate. There is a second door. Father dragged back by the daughter's hair, but more animal is. He made a cruel punishment of her daughter. The daughter is not without thought to fight back, but the physical strength of the tooth is too disparate. In such a cold basement, she became a tool for the father's animalistic desires, but also became the daughter's prison. Trapped on the 21st day, Arthur came to visit his daughter, because this day is the daughter's 18th birthday. He gave her a piece of cake, but the daughter was afraid to approach him and just blew out the candles from afar. Next, Arthur pulls out a sexy red dress and forces his daughter to wear it, and then asks her to make a wish. But of course, the wish can't be to get out of here. In the end, the daughter chose a clock, because in the darkness of hell, if you don't know the time, there is no desire to continue living. Arthur agrees, but on the condition that the daughter stops calling him father and calls him by his name. Arthur! That day she ate the canned food Arthur sent, using the cum lid to make a homemade weapon, secretly hidden behind to attack Arthur, but Arthur was on guard and he easily snatched the weapon. Her resistance was once again rewarded with a severe beating and violation. By this time, she already had two children. Due to the confined space and malnutrition, the children were thin and weak. The eldest daughter also suffered from severe asthma, but the father didn't care about his children's health. He bought medicines for his pets, surprisingly, and even told his daughter, there is no difference between a human and a dog. At this time my daughter was expecting her third child. She knew that it was no longer possible to raise a third child here, so she asked her father to take this child upstairs and raise her, to stop the family from searching for her. Arthur eventually agreed. Early the next morning, the mother found the newborn baby and a letter written by her daughter on her doorstep. The letter states that she is living in poverty and is unable to raise the child and asks the mother to stop looking for her. The mother carries the baby away but ignores a small note underneath the baby. The pleading note, unfortunately found by Arthur, enrages him and he goes to the basement and throws the note in his daughter's face, hoping to ruin her expectations. He then once again forces his daughter to wear the red dress she hates. It was storming outside that day, and the rain seeped into the basement. The daughter seemed to see hope, and began to keep digging and signaling outside for help. A passerby sees her signal, and tells Arthur. Arthur rushed to the basement, and beat his pregnant daughter. Ultimately, the baby did not survive, and he calmly carried, and buried the miscarried child. Before long, his granddaughter's asthma gets worse, and his daughter begs to be taken to a hospital for treatment. But Arthur, fearing she will run away, never agrees. Dad! Please, just... I just want to be with her, please! 20 years later, his daughter calls out to her father again, and his offense, agreeing to take his granddaughter to the hospital. Through the doctor's treatment, the daughter is out of life-threatening danger. This time, the daughter finally finds the opportunity to send out a distress signal, exposing 24 years of abusive captivity, and she and her children finally escape from the dungeon.